This is Brian Rogers for BBK Performance to show you how to quickly and easily add even more horsepower, torque, and throttle response to the 2005 to 2009 Mustang GT using our cold air induction system, which is available in a variety of finishes. Today we'll be using our polished aluminum version, part number 17360. It's important to know that the BBK cold air induction system is a direct bolt on with no additional tuning required. We begin with the baseline dyno run. The result, 260 horsepower and 266 foot-pounds of torque. To remove the stock airbox, loosen the hold down bolt on the driver's side fender apron. Then twist the green locking clip on the PCV hose and pull it back and away from the inlet tube. Now slide the red locking clip back and unplug the mass air sensor by squeezing the release tab and pulling it. Loosen the hose clamp at the throttle body, pull the inlet tube away, and lift the entire assembly out of the car. Gently pry up the center pins of the plunger type fasteners in the plastic radiator cover. Pry out the outer sections of the plungers, then lift and remove the radiator cover. Now unbolt and remove the driver side radiator hold down. Use a T20 Torx to remove the mass air sensor from the stock air box. Note that the sensor has the word flow and an arrow printed on it. The arrow always needs to be pointing away from the air filter and toward the throttle body. The mass air sensor also has an offset bolt pattern to keep it from being bolted on backward. Insert the mass air sensor into the BBK inlet tube and tighten it down with the supplied Allen headed hardware. Install the supplied rubber seal strip to the BBK filter shroud by starting at one end of the top edge and working your way around. You'll need to bend it to make the turn. Back at the car, drop the shroud into place by guiding the hole in the tab over the radiator post. Then, use the original bolt to tighten the shroud to the fender apron and set the filter in place inside the shroud. Now reinstall the radiator hold down and the radiator cover. Place the supplied silicone coupler over the throttle body along with the two large hose clamps and tighten the clamp that attaches the coupler to the throttle body. Install the BBK inlet tube by guiding the oval end into the silicone coupler on the throttle body and the round end through the filter shield and into the mouth of the filter. Then push the filter on fully and tighten the hose clamps. Complete the installation by plugging in the mass air sensor and connecting the PCV hose to the inlet tube. Now let's see what this BBK cold air induction system does for this car on the dyno. Wow, how about another 18 rear wheel horsepower and 22 foot-pounds of torque with no additional tuning required. That's great bang for the buck right there. For more information on this or any of the hundreds of parts that BBK makes for late model cars and trucks, check out bbkperformance.com. Here on the left, try our multiple search options or watch fun and informative product detail and installation videos. Up here on the top, Use the tabs to order or download the latest catalog, find a dealer in your area, or read and download from our instruction sheet library that covers 20 plus years of BBK products. Don't forget to check out our homepage and blog to see what's new. Thanks for watching.